Hi everybody! Um, so the video that I'm filming this week, I thought I would film a video just talking to you all really quickly about drag show etiquette. Now, for those who've never been to a drag show, or for those who do like going to these shows, they're a really fun time and I thought I'd give you five out of a kind of a long list of tips so that next time you do go to the show, you'll be able to enjoy yourself and not ruin my fucking night. Deal? Okay, tip number one is cheer. Do you see what these queens are wearing? When they get out there on stage and they're doing splits and cartwheels and they're asking you if you're having a good time, you cheer, you stomp your feet, you woo, you do whatever you need to to keep the energy up in the room. If you are dead and you're just sitting there all like, they're gonna notice that and they're gonna call your ass out on it too. They're out there working their ass off. The least you can do is cheer for them. Tip number two is tip. If you like what you see on that stage, go up and give them a dollar. Give them two dollars. Give them five dollars. Give them some money. If you just go and you get in everyone's way and you're not tipping and you're just sitting there watching Snapchat and Instagram and all the other programs and I don't know what they're called, all the other apps, um, then you're, you're wasting their time, you're wasting my time, and you're wasting your own time. If you go, bring a couple bucks. You don't have to tip everybody. I get it. I, I definitely get it. But at least tip one of them. It can't hurt you. Tip number three that I have has more to do with um, some people that I think just don't understand what a show even is. When you're at a show, there's usually going to be an MC, usually another drag queen or king, um, out there running the show, getting everybody's attention, cheering, talking about whatever's going on. And sometimes they go out in the crowd. Now, if you're sitting close to the stage, or depending on the the venue. If you're sitting where the MC is walking, odds are they may engage with you. Now, that being said, don't try to one-up the MC. Don't try to be funnier than her. Don't try to be cuter than her. You sit there, you let her joke with you, you sit down. End of story. Um, no drag, no, no queen or MC, they don't want to be one up by some sorority girl who's out for her bachelorette party or whatever. So when she comes around to you, you stand up, you laugh, you give her your name, you go up on stage, you do a twerk contest, whatever they want you to do, you do it, and then you sit down. Be a good sport about it. Tip number four and five kind of go hand in hand. Um, it's kind of like where you should sit and where you shouldn't sit. If you are not going to be tipping the queens or if you're not there to enjoy the show or you know interact with the MC, um, don't sit in the very front. Go to the back, go back by the bar, walk up and tip when you need to. And But also, if you are there to enjoy the show and you want to be right up on the stage, don't get on the stage. Do not mess with their, their performing area. You don't get involved in that. But get up as close as you can to them and, and enjoy the show and make sure you give them you know, as much money as you can. Buy them a shot for all I care. But yeah, four and five is basically where to sit, where not to sit. I cannot tell you how many times that we've had a table or a booth somewhere and people just get up in our gig and, and they just sit on their phones. I'm like, excuse me. I was like, we paid for these seats. You better get to stepping, honey. Go to the back. I think that's everything. Yeah, that's all I have for y'all today. Quick little video. I will be bringing my camera out and about more. I'll be doing some Q&As coming up, so make sure you follow me on uh, Twitter and Instagram, and if you're friends with me on Facebook, just watch out for a, uh, a Q&A status coming up soon. Hope you all have been enjoying the videos. Give it a big thumbs up if you agree with any of those tips for the drag show. Um, let me know in the comments below any tips that you may have or any stories about um, what's happened at a show that you've ever been at. And yeah, I'll see you all next weekend. Bye.